In this video, we're gonna talk about BUN. JavaScript developer has gone tired of reinventing new frameworks. So now we are building new JavaScript runtime. At the beginning, we had Node.js, then rearranged the letter to make Dino, and now we got production ready BUN 1.0 release. BUN is a fast, all-in-one toolkit for running, building, testing, and debugging JavaScript and TypeScript from a single file to a full stack application. With BUN, we don't need tools like NPM, PNPM or YARN because BUN is at least 17 times faster. BUN takes only 0.36 seconds to compile your code, whereas it takes about 6.44 seconds in the case of PNPM, 10 seconds for NPM and 12 seconds for YARN. So here are the three features that you should know for BUN. Firstly, BUN supports hot reloading. BUN supports hot reloading out of the box, so you don't need tools like NodeMon. It will automatically refresh the server when running JavaScript or TypeScript code. You can replace npm run with BUN run to save over 150 milliseconds every time you run a command. Secondly, BUN is also a JavaScript bundler with best in-class performance and on ESBuild compatible plugin API. So we don't need things like ESBuild or Webpack. Lastly, BUN has both ES modules and CommonJS compatibility. Another great feature about BUN is that we can use ES modules and CommonJS together in the same file, which was not possible in Node.js. Apart from that, BUN has built-in support for the web standard APIs that are available in browser, such as Fetch, along with the extra BUN APIs like BUN.File to lazy read a file, and bun.write to write a file to the local file system, which is a lot simpler than Node.js. So why is bun so fast? Bun is fast because it uses the JavaScript core engine, while Node.js uses the JavaScript V8 engine. The former has been optimized for faster startup time. Conclusion, these are the features provided by BUN 1.0 release. BUN is only ready for production in Mac OS and Linux operating systems right now. The Windows version is still experimental. At the moment, only the JavaScript runtime is supported for Windows and not the package manager, the bundler, or the test runner. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel. See you in the next video.